Good morning. I'm Sergeant Huff with the Fall Police Department, and I'll be doing the crime report for the period of February 24th through February 27th, 2014. In the reporting period, we had a total of 40 arrests, 32 traffic, and 8 misdemeanor felony, and investigated two accidents. In our offense reports, we had breaking and entering motor vehicle and theft of property, Highway 165, $230 in currency taken. We had a terrorist threat, uh, person on person. It was later reduced to menacing, and that occurred on damage road. We had uh, using false identi identity to obstruct justice and attempting to elude law enforcement. It happened around Highway 30. We had a uh, theft of property on State Docks Road. A brown and black colored tablet. I'm assuming that's a computer tablet. Uh, information. Criminal trespass, Highway 30. Harassment, uh, Fairlane Meadows Apartments. Domestic violence and criminal mischief, uh, South of Fall Avenue. Vehicle is damaged. Uh, reckless endangerment and attempting to elude law enforcement, Central Avenue. We had possession of marijuana second to South Fall Avenue. Information. We had a theft of property second felony. That's, uh, that was shoplifting at Walmart. Theft of property. Okay. Theft of property second, Cotton Hill Road. A 50 ton press and a car dolly was taken. And, uh, I believe that's supposed to read credit card fraud, not fool. So that's a misprint there, miss typo. Information damage, domestic violence third, and that occurred uh, Bluff Park Apartments. Yeah, lost wallet. And harassment South Fall Avenue. Theft of property on Ingram Street, $120 in currency. We had harassment, South Randolph. And on our arrest reports, we had Samuel Freeman arrested, domestic violence. And that would be the domestic violence um, that was changed from criminal, I mean, from a terrorist threats to menacing. Domestic violence. We Sherry Beatty arrested, theft by deception. Taylor Perez driving while suspended, that was a failure to appear on a traffic. Darlene Page, theft of property second. Miranda Wright, possession of marijuana second. Jeremy Marshall, assault second degree. And Jeremy Marshall, using false identity, identity to obstruct justice and attempting to elude law enforcement. One of the reports mentioned the fact that uh, there was a problem at Walmart. Has Walmart stepped up their security in the last week or so in any way? I didn't know if they were hiring off-duty policemen. Or no, since they opened the new super center, They've really been conscientious about shoplifting. Really, have really done a great job the last what, two years now. Mm -hmm. um, some of it just stands out more because it's uh, high dollar stuff. During Christmas now, they'll employ off-duty police officers. And, uh, but other than that, you know. okay. With regard to the return of. Chief Connor. Do you know anything there? No, sir. They haven't told us anything. And do we, under, do we understand, was it presented to the grand jury? or? I haven't heard anything but rumors. And uh, that information is kept from everybody. It's, it's secret. Mm -hmm. So I, I don't know. Do we know if it's been referred to any state agencies? Just rumors, all I've heard. Um, I, I can't. Yeah. Okay. Not trying to put you on the spot. I'm trying to understand. Yeah, I, yeah. Hey, yeah. 